Every year, the village of Reifnitz in Austria hosts a major Golf GTI meet. Thousands of VW enthusiasts descend on the lakeside community to celebrate their beloved car and themselves. But the Golf GTI doesn't have the annual extravaganza entirely to itself. The fans agree on one thing. All VW drivers have to come to Reifnitz at least one time in their life. It's a tradition and a must-do every year. You have to take the time off for this. What's an Audi doing here, though? These days, the meet also welcomes car marquees other than from the Volkswagen Group. Seat Leons and VW Polos are joined by BMWs. But again, on one issue, visitors are united. Anything but an Opel. Opel! <laughs> the sun shines over Wolfsburg and the whole world laughs at Opel. The event is a nice image booster for the VW Group. It's little wonder then to see the company put on some special treats for its faithful following. Eurodance Outfit Scooter were recruited to present the Design Vision GTI concept car, complete with extra wide wheel wells, of course, and a distinctly beefy look. The sacred letters GTI bring back special memories for many here. GTI is a dream for any musician, insists drummer Leslie Mandoki. There's a special emotional attachment for him personally because it was the first new car he bought in 1980. The GTI won, black, and naturally with the golf ball gear knob. He always had the back seats down so that he could fit in his drums. 700 kilos, 110 horsepower, his absolute dream car. Seat is also represented in Reifnitz by the sporty end of its model range. VW's Spanish subsidiary has plenty of fans here for a variety of reasons. Because it's a girl's car and it's a head turner. Or alternatively, because Seat is better. With so many evident experts around, we'll leave it to them to decide which car is the better. One thing's for sure, GTI fans are very creative, including when it comes to inventing new sporting disciplines. There's some serious rubber burning going on as drivers try to out-donut each other, cheered on by an ecstatic crowd. Who will manage to burst their slicks in the most spectacular fashion? Maybe we'll see the discipline become an Olympic event someday, and a smoking hot one at that.